Well, hello once again. Uh, recently, I've had a couple of requests to do an installation guide for the most recent version of Stalker Anomaly. So until quite recently, we had the uh, 2.4 beta version 1.5. But back in August, we had um, still 1.5, but it went to beta 3.0. And I'm glad I've actually check this out because um, in the last two or three days we've had uh, another update so I wasn't aware of that so I'm quite glad I'm making this video. So let's go ahead and do the installation. Right so you're gonna need to get all of these you're gonna need part one of three, part two of three, part three of three and then the most recent update. Uh, I tend to open them with 7-zip, but you, you can use um, other programs. First things first, I'm just going to make a folder, a bit like over in the corner here, I've got Anomaly 2.4 and 3.0. So let's call this uh, Stalker Anomaly 3.0. Right, so part one, part two, part three, and then the update. So part one, I'm just going to double click on it. I'm using 7-zip. Um, you can extract it to the desktop first and then drop it into the folder, or you can go straight to the folder. It doesn't matter. Whatever, you know, everyone's routine's a bit different. So I'm going to get it to um, drop straight into the folder. It's a fairly big file, so it'll take some time, so I'll cut straight back when it's done that. Right, that's the first file, so let's move that out of the way. Close that, and the same for part two. Extract into the destination folder. And this is an even bigger file, so it'll take some time. And once again, I'll nip back once it's done. And there we go. That's part two taken care of. Put that to one side. And this repeating pattern is going to carry on. Right, so part three is, uh, I believe, a much smaller part. Uh, you get more files, but it's still the same thing. You're just going to extract them into there. And the very last file is bigger than this file, but smaller than those two. And I do believe you get asked to overwrite something in this uh, final file. I think you do. And if so, then uh, say yes. Yeah, so you're prompted to overwrite anything and just go yes to all. And there we are. All done. So I'm just going to load up the game quickly to make sure um, that the sound's turned down can't really have the music playing otherwise I'll get a copyright strike so I'll do that I'll pop back and then we'll load up the game just to show you that it works all right so double click on the game file and just double click on the exe and you'll get prompted for your graphics uh, options so you want uh, most likely DX11, depending on your hardware. Shadow map, that's the default. Um, I'm just going to leave everything at default for this video. There's no point um, getting too uh, particular about settings. Right, without further ado, let's fire it up and see if it works.
And there it is. So let's um, let's just start a new game for the purposes of this video. Uh, I don't care what loot I have. Um, there we go. That'll do. And start. Right. This is um kind of default settings. I don't think I've even adjusted my field of view, so it may look a bit odd. Let's do that, actually. Yeah, 75, that's too low for me. I quite like 85, 83, 85, maybe 90, depending on the mod. But as you can see, it works. And all that remains for you to do now is to get playing. So I hope it's helped a, a few people that have asked me to uh, do a video on it. And I'm sorry it's taken me a while to do it. I've been very busy. So hopefully it's not too late. But anyway, thank you for watching. Uh, take care and I'll see you next time in the next upload. Bye for now.